Guys, I remember I showed up to group in 2010 and I walked into the fucking team room and it was son of anarchy everything. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So today I wanted to speak to you guys about the top three piece of content, whether it's a movie or TV shows that has influenced the regiment the most since I've been part of it. Now, when I say influence, I'm not talking about like tactics and guys deploying and battle rhythm or any of that. I'm talking about more so the culture itself. The very first one, guys, is the movie 300, which came out, I want to say in 2006, starting Gerard Butler. Badass movie, guys, and the guys within the regiment just ate that shit up, right? Everywhere you look, guys were getting shields tattooed on their bodies, right? Team shirts were being made everywhere, guys, with your shield or on it. It just spread like wildfire, guys, the entire regiment. Till this day, I'm sure some of these guys still have their tattoos inspired by the movie 300. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, which type of SF guy you are as we go through this list, all right? So, yes, that's the very first one, guys, the movie 300. Now, the guys from 300, guys, they got tired of walking around. They looked at Leonidas. They're like, hey, man, what's going on? Why are we doing all this fucking walking when there's motorcycles, denim jeans, in leather jackets right over there, right? So they hopped on and they made their way to fucking the son of anarchy, guys. I remember I showed up to group in 2010 and I walked into the fucking team room and it was son of anarchy everything. I'm talking about team shirts. Guys were getting back from deployments and buying freaking Harley Davidsons like nobody's business, right? So they quickly left Sparta and they traveled down to freaking motorcycle gangland and they became part of the son of anarchy that was the next show guys that made its way through the regiment and spread like wildfire right so son of anarchy if you haven't seen it awesome show right and it, again till this day i'm sure a lot of you guys have you know son of anarchy son of afghanistan was one of the team shirt that i got when i first got the group let me know in the comment section below guys if you've seen that show truly awesome right now fast forward guys son of anarchy dudes are on their bikes and they rode off to valhalla right they fucking stumble into viking territory and at this point all of the guys that had the motorcycle tattoos with dudes on there they're now fucking putting bears on all their dudes right they're fucking getting beards tattooed on all their dudes. And that was the next craze, guy. The Vikings. If you guys haven't seen Vikings, awesome show, right? And that is the next craze, guys. Till Valhalla. You see that shit everywhere now within group. That is currently the hot thing followed by John Wick. Guys, let me know which type of SF guy you are by letting me know which one of these that you have tattooed on your body. Like I said, I've seen it all, right? I've seen guys go from Spartan to freaking biker to now fucking Viking warrior, right? I've seen it all. Let me know which one inspired you. I don't have any tattoos, but if I did, if I was into that, it would probably be Leonidas in the 300s, all right? Appreciate you guys watching, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Until next time, take care of yourself.